Buccaneer here, back again with the VZ58. And this time, we're going to be talking about another accessory for the VZ58. This time, rather than talking about the upper and lower handguard or the tactical bolt release, we're going to be talking about the ambidextrous magazine release. The big paddle, which allows you to easily remove the magazine. Now, on the VZ, it's kind of a pain in the butt, depending on which version you have. For magazine release. Typically they're very small. But on this one right here, as you can see from the photos before, but this one right here is huge. Ambidextrous can be used right or left-handed, no problem whatsoever. The nice thing about it is you can lock your magazine in there and you can even release it with your trigger finger. That's how good this product is. This is just a beautifully done setup. Where you can just go ahead and remove the magazine. Hopefully, I don't break anything here. Move the magazine, remove the magazine just by pushing forward with your finger. So you can go from a shooting position to just pushing forward with your finger. And you can be working to go ahead and get that next magazine in there. Super high speed. And once again, this is a product from Neat Arms, N E I T. And uh, this particular one is uh, 6061 uh, T6 aluminum, and it's, it's type 3 anonite, so it's, it basically has the same finish as uh, parkerizing. So it's going to have a nice matching appearance, and it is super tough. Anytime you have anodizing, it really toughens up the aluminum. So now that you have an ambidextrous magazine release, you can release it right-handed, left-handed, or with your right hand or left finger, or, or let me put that left hand or right finger, put it that way. Depends, depends on if you're right handed or left handed. And this way you can go ahead and just press forward and release it with your trigger finger while you're reaching for a magazine. So you can release and just concentrate on, on inserting the magazine. Nice, very nice idea. I love the idea that you can release it with your trigger finger. That right there made all the difference for me because uh, it, it's just so natural to do it that way. You know, it's, it's just easy to do. And the ambidextrous, because it is nice and wide paddle design, it's easy to get to. With gloves on, you can get to it. For me, I typically wear gloves at the range. It's easier on my hands. And that way, even with gloves on, I can easily get to that. And once again, this is a, a no fitting. This is a swap and go part. So it's a drop in fit. You remove the old one, just a pin. Now uh, you go ahead and remove the old one. It's no problem whatsoever, trust me. And it doesn't require any knowledge. You don't require any schematics. Uh, just remove the old one, put the new one in, and you're done. Matter of minutes, and you already have a very much improved magazine release and the magazine release was and eh, well as far as I'm concerned it was the the bad part of the VZ uh, there were several different versions depending on what year they were manufactured and this rifle had the worst one it had a really tiny one and it was really hard to reach and it's just forward of the trigger guard so you really had to fumble around to get to it and so it, it slowed down the whole process of sticking another magazine in there. You know, I love my VZ. And by making it easier for me to do magazine changes, well, I love it even more now. So this is a very good product. If you have a VZ, highly recommend it. Once again, you know, it, it, it's neat arms that you can get this from. Highly, highly, highly recommend it. It is a very good product. If you have the VZ, I highly recommend the ambidextrous magazine release as well as the tactical bolt release. Those are two items that you absolutely should have to upgrade your rifle. There's just no, no doubt about it. Those are two parts you have to have. It is that good. Highly recommended. So if you have any comments or questions, like I said, leave it below. Don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to rate the video. Otherwise, I don't know how good we're doing here. And up next, one last accessory for the VZ. 
So, until then, I'll catch you in the next video. What you want? What you want? What you want?